Matt Walsh is up to his old BS again. This time, instead of attacking the trans community, he is directing his attacks at the healthcare providers that support us. And he's doing it with more of his usual lies. He sent a producer in to give a convincingly unmasculine performance and lie to medical staff at Fox and Plume to obtain a letter of approval for an orchiectomy and then tries to use that as proof that these organizations are corrupt. The only thing, in fact, that Matt Walsh has proven here is, as he continues to grasp for gotcha journalism, is to show that if you go to a doctor and lie about your symptoms, lie about the medication you're, temp you're taking, and lie about the previous medical diagnoses you've received, that you can get approval for surgery. This is so far from news and so far from a true expose that I'm not really going to spend much time on this story. I just wanted. I just want to know when Matt Walsh is going to come to information without having to lie first to get it. He lied to people to get them to participate in his What is a Woman mockumentary, which itself contains lies and false claims, including the BS about litter boxes in schools. Now he's got a video producer, a video of a producer of his lying to medical professionals to get approval for a surgery and trying to turn around and say that it's proof that the system is somehow a racket. 